SoCal surfers may have a new tool to keep sharks away. As KCAL's Elise Martinez tells us, researchers say it's as simple as shining a light on the problem. Andre Zaitsev spends a lot of time at Santa Claus Beach in Santa Barbara County. In the back of my head, I definitely know that they're there. Even though it's a well-known hot spot for juvenile great whites. It's a breeding ground for them because there's a lot of food for them. There's a lot of stingrays out in the water. Zaitsev works for A-Frame Surf Shop where he teaches kids to surf. They fly a drone above the water before and during lessons. When we do see a shark coming in, we pull the kids out of the water. Even though he surfs with sharks close by, Zaitsev isn't too worried. You're more likely to get struck by lightning or get in a car crash on your way to go surfing, so I don't think the shark is your biggest worry. Researchers out of Macquarie University in Australia say they may have found a way to reduce human interactions with sharks. In a new study, they put LED lights on the bottom of a seal-shaped foam decoy and found that sharks, for the most part, left the seals alone. The lights essentially distracting the sharks from their prey. The problem is, is that there are a lot of other cues that sharks use to detect their prey. So they use their sense of smell, they use their sense of hearing, they can pick up vibrations, even electric fields in the water. Chris Lowe is a marine biologist and director of the shark lab at Cal State Long Beach. He says the study is a step in the right direction, but don't bet your life on it. If that makes you feel better, that you have a device that works 40 to 60% of the time, great. Um, however, we have to be careful because sometimes we think they make us invincible and we do riskier things than we would do if we had nothing at all. Lo and Zaitsev both say they welcome studies like this one because the more we know about sharks, the better. And whatever draws sharks to humans, the experts say they really aren't that interested. On average, we have about three per year in California. Our high is about seven and our low is zero. Considering other states like Florida, which is the shark bite capital of the world, they have 39 bites per year. California does pretty well. In Carpinteria, Elise Martinez, KCAL News.